Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be uh, doing a new tutorial on how to, well, an updated tutorial on how to overclock a Ryzen CPU, as well as some presets for um, the Ryzen 2200G. So first thing you're gonna wanna, you're gonna wanna do is go to this website. I'll link it in the description. But this is where you download it. It's the official AMD site. So you just scroll down to the bottom and click download now, and save where you wanna download it. Let it download. Alright, so once it's downloaded, just open it. Click yes. Let's do its thing. I'm gonna quickly cancel that because I already have it installed. Um but yeah, it'll just bring you through a small install process. And then after that it will um bring you this little menu. So it's just a warning saying overclocking can damage the CPU over time. See, damage is caused by use of AMD processor out of outside of official AMD specifications or outside of factory settings are not covered by any warranty. So yeah, avoid your warranty. And may not become be covered by your board of manufacturers um, warranty. But you don't really need to worry about that if you already know the dangers of overclocking. It really doesn't affect it that much. So just click OK. And here you have like the new updated Ryzen Master. Looks pretty cool. It looks complicated, but um, really not bad. <laughs> like, um, so here you have speed for each like uh, CPU core. Cores disabled if you want to disable some cores. Uh, voltage, so you can change that depending on what your CPU needs. And then you have APU stuff. I won't get into the APU stuff today, but yeah. So once you get here, you can adjust it. You can find presets online of like good um, overclocks for your CPU. Just search it up, and there will be a bunch of things recommending a different ones. So here is mine for the um, Ryzen 3 2200G. Same normal CPU voltage and um, speed is f oh, 3.9 gigahertz. Yeah, it works pretty well. It still keeps pretty cool on the stock cooler. And yeah, it gives that like extra CPU performance you may need. So hope this helps. Um, goodbye.